Just so I'd find my place here, Ben, why don't you give me your name and position? Or ben Mays. Some identifying mark. Madison, Wisconsin, right. vice president of Wisconsin Normal and Democratic candidate for the U.S. Senate in 2012. What's going on down here today, Ben? Well, this is the 39th annual Great Midwest Marijuana Harvest Festival. It's been a long time. Uh, we'll be parading up to the Capitol in uh, about 45 minutes. Uh, this one's a little special in that we finally have a chance to pass a medical marijuana law. Uh, text finally came back from the Legislative Reference Bureau this week. Uh, Representative Pocan and Senator Erpen back will be having the formal introduction on October 22nd, giving a little bit of time to collect some more co-sponsors. And I'm uh, pretty optimistic it'll pass this year. Uh, Governor Doyle's uh, indicated to the La Crosse Tribune a couple months ago that if it emerges from the legislature, he'll sign. It seems like we've been close a couple times before. Um, feel a little bit better even this well, time? Well, this is as long as we had uh, the last few assembly speakers basically weren't willing to let it come to a vote. I think we probably had a majority in the assembly to pass it if it had gotten there, but he had let a couple uh, obstructionist members of the caucus bottle it up. What's the the um, the method in this bill of someone actually using marijuana? They have to get a prescription from a doctor. How would it work? Well, it's not technically a prescription because that is a relation. Prescription is between the patient and pharmacist, and. That relationship is governed by federal law. So you'd get a, an order or recommendation from your doctor. You would then take that to the State Department of Health, who would issue you a card authorizing the patient to possess a relatively small but not tiny amount, uh, and to grow up to 12 plants, of which three can be in the flowering stage. Thank you.